I am a cowboy. I'm an off-brand pink bear with a rainbow on its belly. Amazing. Mm -hmm. We're starting off strong with a fan favorite. This is the Haunted Cemetery. So we created the cemetery based off of um, the success of last year's Spooky Night, and we really wanted to offer you this really fun, spooky landscape on your topper. Just our designer who created this, who's super talented, she put in all these beautiful, amazing little details like RIP, and little headstones, little um, pumpkin on the end as well. There's a lot of really wonderful details in here that our artists are mindful about putting in. So definitely grab this because uh, it's so fun and so impactful. That brings me to this next one, which is the Spooky Night, which is another landscape. Um, similar, I would say, style yeah. as, as the, the Haunted Cemetery. Definitely. They are kind of like brother and sister. Seeing a bunch of people were asking for more purples. Um, so I think this is a great Halloween purple top ring. Oh yeah. And look at how well it goes with our outfits. I mean, <laughs> as a cowboy and as an off-brand pink bear, we look great. We look amazing. Yeah. We are killing it. <laughs> the spooky potions. If you haven't entered our Halloween giveaway yet, there is still time. I'm posting a video to Instagram or TikTok with your costume um, and your favorite pair of pairs. Of course, get creative with it. This ends October 23rd. Tag pair eyewear and include the hashtag scared with pair in your caption. And with that, you'll be entered to win a $200 gift card. So you don't want to miss that. So for details, make sure to check out our pin post on Instagram for all of the logistics. Okay, Moving on to the Enchanted Gems. This um, is the classic jack o lanterns So a classic Halloween pumpkin look. Another bring back, very simple and easy to kind of be, you know, festive without being too in your face. It's very subtle. It's very graphic, but you know, a really nice nod to the holiday. If you're not into like the thematic and busyness of the other toppers. And you can't have Halloween without a little pumpkin. Exactly. Uh, to the spooky pumpkin, which is similar in the sense where we're talking about jack-o'-lanterns and pumpkins, but it's um, photorealistic. If you maybe aren't as into kitschy, bright color designs, this one's a lot more subtle and um, subdued. Look at it. This is very cute. I absolutely love this dark blue and this green. Mm -hmm. We have this kind of like highlight um, on the corners from the jack-o'-lanterns. It's a really great top frame. We don't have a ton of yellow um, in our collections, but this is a great little pop of, of that yellow, mm -hmm. a little, little warm tone. A little bit of a pop of color just to grab, grab the eye, but really easy to kind of pair back with a very simple, easy outfit. This is the pumpkin pin dot, um, the Halloween tortoise, which is a lot more abstract mm -hmm. and kind of, I would say evergreen. You can kind of wear this any time of year. This is the tangerine tortoise split. It gives you subtle elevation. Um, and again, it's very easy, um, an easy topper to wear with um, your, your outfits. And on top of that, like for those of you who've been collecting our torts, we're adding one to your collection right now. Of course. There's literally something for everybody in this collection. Your friends, refer them out to pair and say like, are you looking for something fun? Maybe try the candy corn stripes. I mean, you can't have Halloween without like tried and true candy corn, of right? Course. Like the Halloween sprinkles. Now, the reason why I think about childhood when I see this is it reminds me of those store bought cupcakes. And that is literally the inspiration. Is the haunted house. So cute. The minute I saw this design, very reminiscent of those scratch-off papers as a kid. Look at that. We wanted to give you rainbow. We listened to the Pear family of Facebook group, and you guys have been you guys love color. So we really wanted to give you rainbow Halloween goodness. Next up we have the trick-or-treaters. <laughs> this one is so cute. <laughs> So we have a designer here who's absolutely amazing at drawing animals. We touched upon this on the last live, um, but she's so good at them. And so we really were just like, what is missing from this collection? We really wanted to encapsulate that feeling again, nostalgia, trick-or-treating. And so we said to ourselves, why not fun, cute animals? As trick or treaters. I love it. Staying on the whole animal train, we have another animal related print. This one's a lot more subdued. Um, we have 
the Halloween bats. Next up we have the Boo Crew. Ah, you can't have Halloween without ghosts. Who doesn't want sassy ghosts? This is the slime. This is an interesting take on the split. Mm -hmm. Do you wanna talk about it? Yeah. We basically, um, we, in this kind of age of slime, we really wanted to like represent it. And we were kind of like, okay, so how do we do this? And so really kind of has like this 90s nostalgia slime vibe. And so we were just kind of like perfect. Uh, but this is it. Look how chic that is. These are limited edition. Yes. Remember, you don't want to be ghosted. You, you don't want to be ghosted. So pick them up while you can. Yes. This is a new one. Top frame, this is the Spooky Webs. Yes. Another kind of new take on a split design, yeah? Yeah, so we really wanted to give spiders, but um, without having, we understand there's arachnophobia out there, so we really wanted to do it in like a very fun, um, graphic way without being too terrifying. This is another uh, ring bag. I mean, uh, really, truly, like this is so fun. This is a bring back by popular demands. Can we, oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> This frame, this top frame was one of the best sellers. You guys absolutely loved this design. This is the lovely skeletons. Oh, and it was such a lovely surprise to see that you guys really, really loved this top frame. This one was truly just inspired by um, a luxury brand. Um, uh, so like it really encapsulates and has like a mixture of digital and illustration as well. So it has like this very beautiful romance dark romance feel to it. Perfect for the winter and fall season. Yeah. And really can live outside of all the Halloween season in October. So really, truly pick this up because it really has legs to um, really be worn like into the winter. Into the winter, into yeah. The winter. This is, it's very gothic. Um, mm -hmm. And I know a lot of people who have that aesthetic. So this would fit their, like their everyday look. This one's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> This is another we'll bring back, so by popular demand. This is the skull and crossbones. This is another bring back from last year. Um, simple yet festive, yeah. if I do say so myself. Very classic design, really truly again versatile for any outfit. Murder. You won't. <laughs> <laughs> for those ghosts, for those of you who love murder podcasts. All of those like true crime fanatics out there. Um, so this is a bring back, and this is also this is my favorite top frame from the, like this is my tried and true favorite top frame from this collection. It is it's so simple. Yes. But, but impactful. But impactful. Yeah. It's again if you're not into a lot of blacks, a lot of dark colors. This is a good white with a pop of red, mm -hmm. if we think about it in that sense. It's so fun and definitely a conversation starter too. Definitely. And it's definitely, when you look at it, you don't think obviously blood splatter. It yeah. really registers as a texture. Mm -hmm. um, it's really fun, um, but it's kind of like a great conversation starter too. Again, like, oh, what are you wearing today? I love your top frames. The blood splatter. Oh, oh my God, tell me more about it. <laughs> I have worn this one outside of Halloween. Um, it's just, it's such a, a I was gonna say cute, it's such a it classic be. like color scheme, just red and white. Mm -hmm. um, and as I said, I wear a lot of black, so this is a great pop into my wardrobe. Um, so that wraps up what our collection is for Halloween. The design team did an amazing job at creating so many great new ones. And I would say this is on the side of being one of the larger collections that we put out every year, right? Mm -hmm. It's like such a fan favorite. So we really wanted to deliver a very impactful um, collection that really encompasses everyone. Let us know your thoughts. Like, what do you, what did you guys think about this collection? Did yeah. you like it? What do you think of the colors? What do you think of the designs? Let us know your thoughts in the Pear Family if you Tell haven't us. joined. That. Join the Pear Family on Facebook. Follow us on Instagram, and you'll know when we do more of these lives. Mm -hmm. We're definitely going to be doing some more lives in the future with um, future collections, um, and then maybe some other stuff. All of y'all have a fantastic rest of your day. Um, and don't forget to enter that Halloween costume contest. It ends October 23rd. So signing off, this is Nancy and Andy, and we'll see y'all again soon. Bye. Bye.